Hello everyone, my name is Holly Trooper and today I'm walking you guys through how to fix text loss issues in your LSPDF file. Before I get started, I do want to make you guys aware that basically this video is for people who have already tried all the basic stuff, which is turning down your graphic settings in your LSPDF, in your GTA 5, I keep saying LSPDF 5 because I'm used to that kind of thing, in your GTA 5 graphic settings, you want to make sure that that is turned all the way down to the point where you don't get any texture loss anymore, depending on your specs and things like that. And obviously, if that didn't work for you, then the next thing you guys want to try is make sure you turn your variety population and variety density all the way down. That is a main reason for texture loss as variety population. It stops so many cars and different peds spawning in so it doesn't have to render different models. And population, obviously, is a population how often things spawn, meaning obviously it doesn't have to render as much. And then, basically, if you've done all of that, if it still isn't working, you've tried resetting, you've tried everything you possibly know what to do and you tried other videos and this this is only a solution for LSPDFR as most of you only will know on LSPDFR so this is how you fix your text loss with LSPDFR if you've already tried all the basic settings in your GTA 5 graphic options so what you guys want to do is bring up your GTA 5 main directory Windows C, Program Files 86, Steam or Rockstar Games or Epic Games Steam apps and common. Choose the GTA 5 folder that is like not working properly or the one that you've modded. Double click on your LSPDFR and if you see the little LSPDFR configuration settings folder, file even, is that's what we're going to be editing. You can know which one it is because it's basically the white page with a little cog next to it. It's pretty self explanatory. The cog means your settings so you know that you can edit it. You double click on that. You guys will be able to see that you have main preload all models and that should be set to false. So basically, if that isn't set to false and as usual it should be set to true, then basically that is what is going to be causing most of the time, which is what you're going to be causing your texture loss. Before we go any further and, it's, and this hasn't worked for you and you start commenting down the section this hasn't worked and it's such a waste of my time. I physically cannot go through, or like mentally, whatever you want to say, I cannot go through every single issue that there is with texture loss. And it's the same with your LSPDFR crashing. I can only go through the most common reasons. If your LSPDFR texture loss is still going on after this, you can join my Discord, which is in the link down below, and in my help team can help you out personally. They can go into calls with you. They can, you can send them screenshots. They can send them to share your screen on the Discord. And it's much easier if this does not work for you. But most of the time this should work for you unless you have a separate issue. But if you've already tried all of the things I've told you guys to do already. Then you need to try out this. And if that doesn't work then as I just said go into my discord and I will. Or my helper team will help you out. Most of the time it isn't me. Most of the time it is my helper team. And because of that helper team I do not need. I do not want uh, direct messages for help. If you can, you can feel free to message me, say thank you and things like that, or just want to chat in general. But please do not message me for help with LSPDFR. If you're already in my server, as I will not, I will not reply back to it. I will ignore it because you can just request help in my LSPDFR server, and it's just as good as me. In fact, most of them are probably better than me. I wouldn't be surprised. So if you guys do need help, please do not message me. My inbox is full. I've got tons of friend requests, so please do not message me or add me as a friend if it is only for help. And please do not just join my Discord server. If you're only looking for help and you're just going to leave, please be an active member. That's all I'm going to say. I understand if you need help with LSPDFR. But please, if you are going to join, to return the favour, to make sure you are active in my Discord server. Because it really means the world to me. See, logging in, seeing an active Discord server and seeing an active community is awesome. But you guys on my YouTube channel alone are really active, which is nice to see. We are on almost 400 subscribers now. We are like two away the last time I checked and we are, by well, the looks of things, are actually going to be making it to 400 subscribers by the end of this month, which is crazy. I never thought I would get there. I never thought we would get there like in the end of the month. So I didn't really plan anything, but I can guarantee you guys I will get something awesome planned. Maybe it'll be a face to face. I'll show off my setup and maybe it'll just be some tech kind of thing. So I could do like tech, maybe it'd just be like a completely different kind of video. 
a special, maybe it could be a live stream as well. I could do like a, a setup reveal and a live stream, although I am getting a new setup next year, beginning of next year, around like January time. So it's kind of out of date. I guess it would be out of date very, very quickly. But I guess I could do a set of reveal I still, and then I could just update it later on down the line. If you guys also have spare money lying around, then make sure you check out my Patreon. That is down in the description below. As I said, if this didn't work for you, and you've already tried everything else, you've already renamed your preload all models settings in your LSPFR config, then obviously you need some further help, and you can join my Discord server for that. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I um, apologise, I am apologetic, I do apologise. If this ending was a little bit stretched out, because I do want to thank you guys so much for getting me almost past 400 subscribers in a month. I literally gained 100 subscribers in a month, which is crazy. So thank you guys so much for that, and I'll see you guys in the next LSPDFR or GTA 5 video.